<laughs> like, where's your audio? You know? Where the fuck is your audio? Like, where's this guy's audio? Standing right there. Huh? Doesn't exist. This guy's moving, strafing. Nothing. Don't hear him at all. I know the guy's firing at him. I'm thinking, okay, he killed him, so I just killed the guy who killed him. This guy's still alive. I'm going like this. Don't hear nothing. Hey, Doc. I think we found that audio you've been looking for. It's behind that wall over there. Behind that wall. Behind that paywall. I think we now know where that audio is that we all yell and complain about that we don't get in the middle of our matches. It's behind a paywall. Behind a damn paywall. We know about some of the ridiculous business practices that Activision has implemented in this franchise over the years. And this one seems to be the biggest, most scummiest, ridiculous of them all. And Treyarch is guilty by association for this one. This new immersive spatial audio technology is this new audio system that Treyarch has been working on for Black Ops 6 and will be added to Warzone with the Season 1 update. This new enhancement increases directional accuracy within the game, which has been an issue for years. This new audio enhancement can be used with any headset. It is fully implemented within the game. If you want this new audio, you're going to have to fork up some cash and be put on a subscription in order to better hear your enemies coming around that corner or from behind you. It's the most unbelievable thing I've ever heard in gaming. It's an absolute sin. According to the article, which is linked in the pinned comment down below, it currently it is offering a free trial of this new audio system, but of course, eventually, free trials will end and you will need to subscribe and pay to get an edge on your enemies. There is a standard option that is free, but of course, if you want this new technology, you're now being forced to pay up to be able to get a leg up on your competition. Bullshit. So far, Activision hasn't said anything officially confirming this, so as of right now, we are only going based off what we see. But if this is true, will they say anything? I won't be surprised if there isn't a peep from them. But what else would you expect? And I wonder, I actually wonder... If there are people that are actually defending this, you know there's going to be weirdos out there justifying this crap. What do y'all think of this? Let me know down in the comments below. Sound off and spread the word because this is a new low for Call of Duty and Activision if this is a thing. And if it is, who knows what else could this lead to? Like the video if you think Activision are scumbags for this one. Just more and more scummy business practices ridiculous subscribe if you're new and click that bell notification icon for more black ops 6 content and of course black ops 6 live streams enjoy the rest of this free for all nuke i'm out of here
shit. You motherfuckers at? left. Let's fucking go, boys. Oh, my God. Call it in. Motherfucker right there. Good old quick draw nuke. Sometimes people can play very ratty on that shit. Almost like the, almost like the whole time I'm 